Are we level? Are we living level? So I had to do it. Hi, I'm Andy. Hello. <laughs> Hi, I'm Andy. I'm Sean. I'm Sean. Um, living level here. We're back with an update. We have a new lens. It's a pancake lens. The Canon 24 millimeter. It's the cutest little lens ever. So we're trying that out. I'm hoping that gets rid of any of the noise um, from the autofocusing. So we are getting ready to go camping. We're going, what, in two weeks? I don't know. We don't got to camp for three weeks from today. Yeah, the kids are home. Yay! Special person's day. You were a special person today. Did you feel special? Yes, I did it. You had a nice... She made me feel uh, special. Yeah, we had a special person day, so you're, we, you get to bring... The kids get to bring someone to school, and they write a little story about them, and it was very sweet and endearing and wonderful. Yep. I sat home and worked. I was not special today, but it was great. So we just got back. Kids are home. We're kind of running around. I just wanted to try out this lens. I'm trying to get our gear ready so when we do start camping, we will be able to record when we're on the road. We plan on doing a lot of footage at the campgrounds to show you the campgrounds that we are at. So we're just going to talk now about some of the places that we're going. My dogs are going to fight. My kids are going to run around. It's going to be great. Right? Um, so where are we starting with right now? I don't know. You oh, just our want to camper. Make sure the mic works. Yeah, make sure the mic works. So our camper is still there. Yankees still... are on's opening day. Yeah, we're watching football or baseball too. So our camper is still at the repair, guys. So thankfully, I think where we left off with our last post was we talked about Progressive came, looked at it, repair guy came, and Progressive paid for all of the replacements. Right? Came to twenty six thousand dollars in damages to our fifth wheel. So they are the value of the unit was forty thousand. So the t the damages didn't come up high enough to total it. So it is being repaired, and we are told it will be ready for us for camping season. So, um, well, we'll see. Next week, he said. So I am so ready to get into our unit and like get the beds made, get it packed up. We had to bring in, when we took it to the dealership to get, or it's not the dealership, it's not the repair guys. I took like a lot of our stuff out, like the chairs, a lot of stuff we store in there. And now it's in our house and shed and there's no room. So I am very ready to put everything back um, to where it belongs. So anyway, so we will talk about where we are going. I wanted to talk about one of our other trips that we did to Luray in April. So people would know what to do when they go to Luray, but... I didn't do that. Okay, so I want to talk about where we are going. There's a lot. I have a list. So we are starting off with our Easter break. I'm going to call it Easter because it's spring break. People yeah, are spring yeah break. we're crashing uh, we're our crashing. friends of ours. Yeah, we were not invited. <laughs> well, we, we, already, invited. we already had a trip booked. Okay, so we I'm had... I'm sure we would have been invited. Yeah, we had a trip booked in Tennessee, and we have, I haven't canceled it yet, we had a beautiful site at Anchor Down in Tennessee, site number 45 with a huge fireplace, gorgeous site, I'm um, going to be calling to cancel that, so if you want an awesome site in April, it's coming available, so instead we're going locally to us, we're going to Maryland, we are going to Castaways, which is one of my absolute favorite campgrounds, you not so it was much. one of our first trips and the whole time trip. it was our second trip it was the whole time i had like a fly, a fly, fly swatter water. in my hand yeah so the, we were novice campers then so we went our one son had strep throat he had a fever and um it was it was a rough one we had our we had friends who were there and it was one of those we tried to hang out with them. Yeah, Rose and Allen. Rose and Allen were there. They had a golf cart. Well, that was going to be great. And uh, it didn't work out so great because the kids were sick. But we still we made the best of it. And we didn't have fans. So now we are professionals when we come and we bring Brady. I'll make her growl. So we brought... So what we've learned is bring lots of fans. Bring If you're going to go to a place that's on the water, Castaways is in Maryland. It's on the water. And it overlooks as a teak. It's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely love this campground. But they, it is, since you are so close to the water, there are a lot of flies. So we didn't have any fans there, but everyone around us had box fans going. Yeah, so. but that was also, uh, was it July? It was in, it was in July. 
Yeah, it, it's a great camera. I don't anticipate flies being. No flies. We're there. Yeah. We'll be there in April. So while we're there, we are going to be going right down the street is Frontier Town. So we'll see if they have anything going on. They have high ropes. They have all kinds of fun things at Frontier Town. That's another one of our favorite places to go with a big group of people. So much fun. They do the horse shows and all that. But I, th I don't know if they're going to have anything going on um, because of the time of your soft season. But then just a little further down the street, you have Azatique. We have the state portion and the federal portion. There's two different things I have to look up look that up because we will go hiking and I know the dogs are allowed to go to one of them and not the other one so we'll be looking at in Berlin Maryland straight by Ocean City Maryland okay so that's our first stop that's April then our uh, Memorial Day weekend we will be at Moose uh, Lake Hill. George Moose Hillock Moose Hillock in Fort Ann by Lake George our absolute favorite campground uh, I don't pick favorites but I can say that's our favorite that when we go back to every single year we went there from the first year that it opened, and we've been going every single year. And it's just been, it wouldn't be right. It wouldn't be a right season. A, it wouldn't be a complete season without going to Moose Hillock. It takes about four hours for us to get there, and we just, we love it. So we'll be there. Then, then we'll be going to Chesapeake Bay KOA, which is in Virginia. And then we'll be heading to Point Sebago, Maine, where we plan on having tons of fun. Then we're heading to Lake Placid KOA, do some hiking, swim in some rivers. So we've been to Lake Placid before, but we've not been to the KOA. We stayed at the North Pole Resorts, so we're looking forward to that. And also going back to the Chesapeake Bay KOA, we haven't stayed there, but we've stayed at, I always get confused, Cherry Stone? Cherry Stone. Ch Cherry Stone. Which is another Which great I wanna, Yeah, I want to go back. Yeah, we'll definitely, yeah, we need to go back there. So this is right in that same area, so we'll see how we do. Uh, so then we go back uh, to Hospitality Creek. That's right here in New Jersey, which is a super fun campground. And then we have a couple more weekend trips that aren't booked yet because they haven't opened up booking yet. So we have to wait. So some local trips and some, some week weekday trips, right? So we are hoping to get back to Otter Lake. We have to wait for a cancellation for in October. It's the Halloween is unbelievable. Uh, we'll, once we book it, then we'll advertise more about that because I want to get a site. It's hard because it's uh, there's a lot of seasonals there, so there's not that many uh, transient sites. Yep. So very hard to book, and also it's it's amazing, right? So I just wanted to see how this was working. Uh, we hopefully will be back with a couple really good episodes from the campgrounds that we're at. I'm planning on doing a bunch of footage and talking while we're there, giving, you know, well, most of our recordings should be all done in the field. And once we get our fifth wheel back, all of our vlogging will be done from the camper. We'll set up in there. So hopefully... In uh, two weeks, we'll be up and rolling. So comment below. If three you, weeks. Three weeks? Three weeks. Yeah. Yeah, the 18th. The 18th. We'll be on the road. Hopefully. Hopefully, we'll have a unit that doesn't have a big hole in the ceiling. So if you know, to, to help me out with Azatik, uh, any good hikes that you like to do in that area. We have been there before. We've seen the wild horses. I'm just hoping to find a good one with uh, dogs. I'll go on all trails, but... My computer is broken. I'm waiting for a new one for next week. So it's really, <laughs> not having a camper, not having a computer, I'm really behind. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying. I'm trying my best. So hopefully this came out good. And we'll see you on the road. It's like, I feel like it's slow motion. We're done. <laughs>